Well, hello. My name is Jeremiah Simeon. As most of my viewers know, uh, all have come to know, as an artist, it's not easy to do what I'm doing. As an artist, it gets difficult at some times. So, if, if anyone thinks about it, you have to do a lot just as a job. Being an artist is a job. You have to work at it to get to a certain point. And in this world, if you do not work at your dreams or goals, then you wind up not getting what you want in this world. So, by making a lot of these documentaries or films, by right now having these songs written, a lot of songs, having these songs out, having these stories out, short stories, or you can call them short shorts, short stories, uh, no short novels or novelists, or full length novels or just novels. By having all of these materials out, especially the clothing line, you can buy uh, my picture on certain clothes. So by having these things out, it's giving the the audience, my fans, if you want to think about them, of the public, a chance to get something from me personally. So, hopefully, my viewers will be able to viewers, fans. That the public would be able to see me and understand myself as an artist. I feel that everybody in the world have their certain ways. I think I specified that in one of my videos. We all have our certain ways. We can say ugly ways or whatever you want to call it. People say certain ways. But I feel that eventually if we just break that mold of who we are as people I think we'll be able to find that line of happiness or we'll be able to find I suppose a line to where we can not only help each other but really find that happiness I think yeah, I think anyone can make it a lot of people in the world not only get caught up in certain things it could be anything it could be gambling drugs I think we as people human beings we get caught up in certain things instead of get caught up in what we need to get caught up at so eventually in time I think we not only get caught up in certain things but I think in time we start to heal that's the healing process So, being an entertainer, not only that because I'm also a comedian, if anybody ever saw any of my comedy acts. So, being a, in a, in an entertainer, we have to make a living doing what we love. And this is something that we love the most. I'm sure that if it would be anyone else, they would be doing the same thing. Okay? Who am I? The creation that the creation. 
creator has made. Hard working, I meet. Generous to greet. Serious the weight. Crazy the place. Torn from here to there. Loveless, not fair. Anger tamed me. Violence killed me. Need a better chance. Need love, which is never there. Truth or dare. The way is the light. I need to be I think people wonder about me personally. I think that if you're an outgoing person and that you do a lot of different things as I ha I am doing or especially as I've done in the past then I think people are just curious. I think every human being is curious by nature. I think that's what we all are. But some people are really curious because they want to know your racial background and your sexual orientation, that's the two things they want to know about people. Why? Who knows? Some people, they're just nosy. <laughs> Need to know. And I think that we in society should not worry about our artists or anyone for that for that fact in the long run it is everyone's personal business not everybody's business when it comes to an individual Well, when it comes to doing what you love the most, here's a little tip. Make sure if you ever go to college or vocational school, trade school, technical school, whatever you want to call it, when you go there, make sure that since you do the best that you can there you can always do the best that you can out in the real world or out in this world thinking about a career as I, I thought about it you have to really love it it's something that you have to really let me see how can I put this uh, you have to really love it do the best that you can even at a job you don't really like. Sometimes if you just put forth some effort and make make it, I'm sure. Well, whatever it is that you need to do. If you do it, you might be able to get that chance to be promoted. Some companies do that, some don't. So, I think it's up to the individual and the corporations. And at the end... The result is what matters. I think so. I don't know about anybody else. But I think that's the bottom line. <laughs> a lot of people do it. A lot of people think, well, that's just what we have to do. And I'm showing you mine you wouldn't want somebody else to take advantage of someone you know. So I don't think we should take advantage of other people. That's something we should think about before we do it. Because in the long run, we're going to be hurting ourselves, not just the other person as well. As uh, some of us know, just like anyone in the world, losing weight is the hardest thing to do. A lot of people try to do it. It's hard. I'll be trying to do it myself sometimes. It's very hard. So uh, in the process, I think we get lost. Especially 
being an entertainer, you get lost in the process of who you are. It's difficult, I feel, that when we, in this society, when we don't think, when we just do, when a lot of people just do all, they think, but they have immoral thoughts or wrongly thoughts, if you want to say, or wrong thoughts, whatever. It's not easy for everybody in the world to make it, but it's not impossible. That's something we have to realize. I think in the long run, it would help us all. Someone else. People bully each other or bully other people on a job. And it's something I do not like. I do not approve of things like that. So, I want every one of us to know that bullying has to stop with me. It stops with you as well. Stop bullying other people. In the long run, we do not want to scar anyone for life. So thank you. And I do appreciate it if you do that. And pass the message along. Bullying should stop with you. Well, thinking about the events in a person's life, I think about it because especially with me personally, with my events that I've been through in my life, I feel that we should be able to look back in our past and not repeat it. It's, it's not easy. It's hard. But I think we can do it if we just try. Okay? And think about this. Global warming exists. I heard from some people that a lot of people think that this is not something that exists, but it does. We need to start finding a solution now or some of our land will be overrun by a certain amount of water. It's almost thinking about over a billion people that needs to be relocated to some other continent, some other country. about certain ideas a lot of people in this world have certain ideas certain either it could be good ideas or bad ideas I have heard or watched on television that many ideas probably are good one of them is basically like uh, bionic arms they have nanotechnologies if you lose a limb which would be a you know, an arm, hand, it could be one of your legs. I feel that we as a society need to think about some of our ideas. They have a lot of immoral ideas too, especially when it comes to sexual favors, uh, sexual inclinations, whatever you want to call it. I feel that every idea starts with an individual and then comes out either or should I say that these ideas are told from one person to another and then eventually 
these ideas come to life or uh, sometimes behind closed doors comes to life whatever and in the long run I think we need to re-evaluate or think of our situation in this world.